the Third Reich, Hitler and shit, the Soviet Union, Joseph Stalin, his hammer and sickle. Europe has spawned a mini conglomerate, mini organization that are keen on perpetuating evil, establishing evil. But do you know what the most evil group to come out of Europe is? Supercell. It's a it's a group, a company backed by this fucking loser. When it comes to a business, when it comes to a company, most people would coin those two terms. Well, this term, integrity, and then read both definitions. Most important aspect of your business and your company. A relationship between the creators and the consumers. Established on some sort of consistent ethical or moral code. And the second definition does an even better job of encapsulating what I'm trying to explain here. When you build something up, you want it to be strong, right? When you are given something, you want it to be working. Here's a better example. Let's just talk about cancer research. Big Pharma. We all have heard the rhetoric that withholding medicine, withholding life-saving medicine is it's wrong it's evil you have the cure then you should mass produce the cure all i'm saying is that for the developers to go out of their way and use shock and awe tactics is extremely shitty it's an extremely evil thing to do especially when you consider the fact that these same developers won't ban cheaters won't create a system for banning cheaters they don't care about cheaters they literally lower the skill ceiling in every single update i mean let's look at every new brawler for the past two months the game literally is pay to win pay to play and when i say the game literally any supercell game is actually pay to win pay to play so if we're going to have such a air quotations relationship where I literally have to pay you money just to play your free fucking game, then don't you think that to some extent, to some degree, you should provide me with a way to ensure that my experience, my quality of life on the game is going to be worthwhile? So why is there why is there none of this being done on any of these games? It's just a bunch of creative development teams running these games into the fucking water. It's almost like in Europe, they're aware of something. I I guess that this fucking Ukraine-Russia war has even a retarded billion-dollar conglomerate like Supercell uh, trying to get the cash grabs and, and trying to get out before it's too late. Honestly... There is literally no worse group to come out of Europe. You should look into Supercell yourself. If you've never heard of them, look into them right now. This company is literally the epitome of evil. It would be like, I gave you a free house. I stocked it with everything you needed. But then I fucking took out all the furniture and the roof. And I still expected you to pay me rent every fucking month.